So if you use Logic, Pro Tools, Reaper, or any other DAW, or in fact, any app that has a lot of key commands, you're probably gonna at some point run into the situation where you need to use Control and Option together as a modifier key for a key command. And as a voiceover user, that can be a little tedious because you'll have to press Control, Option, Tab to do a pass through before you can execute that key command. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. And today we're gonna to take a look at how to set voiceover to only use the caps lock key. So that way you can free up control and option to be used with modifier keys in programs like Logic. So if you're using the Logic Keyboard Ninja key commands, it's gonna be especially helpful and useful when you start to get into more advanced things like comp and takes or even punching in and out because then you can do key commands like Control Option Shift N or Control Option Command P without having to first do Control Option Tab to pass it through. Now, in order to set this up, you'll first need to open VoiceOver Utilities and the key command to open the VoiceOver Utilities is the VO keys and F8, the press VO F8. Opening VoiceOver Utility. VoiceOver Utility, VoiceOver Utility, Window, Utility Categories, Table, General, Selected has Keyboard Focus. And once you have this opened, you can use via right arrow to navigate through this main window. Speak the following greeting after login. Welcome to Mac OS. VoiceOver is on. Com display welcome dialog when VoiceOver starts. On keys to use as the VoiceOver modifier. And that's what you're looking for. Keys to use as a VoiceOver modifier. Now, if I continue with via right arrow, you're going to see a pop-up button where I can pick what I want my VoiceOver modifier keys to be. Caps lock. Keys to use as the VoiceOver modifier. Pop-up button. And you see I have mine set to caps lock already, but if I VO space on this. Menu three items check mark. Caps lock, caps lock. Control option or caps lock. Control plus option or caps lock. And this is the option most of yours will be set to. You'll find that it says control option or caps lock. So once you VO space, you just want to do VO up arrow. Check mark. Caps lock, caps lock. And go to where it says caps lock. Press VO check mark. Caps lock, that. caps lock. Caps lock. Keys to use as the voiceover modifier. Pop-up button. And once you do that, your voiceover will be set to use the cap lock only. And that's pretty much the only setting you really need to change. So you can command W to get out of here if you don't need to change anything else. So I'm gonna hit command W to close this window. Finder, desktop, desktop, empty, group. All right, so that's pretty much it for this one. Like, subscribe, and share for more voiceover tip and Logic and GarageBand tutorials coming up in the near future. And until next time, as always, everyone, happy recording.